With election qualifying for local offices starting a week from Wednesday, the most closely watched race in New Orleans is for district attorney. What promises to be a wild race just got even wilder today with information that another major name may be jumping into the race. Investigative reporter Mike Pearlstein has the story. The race for Orleans Parish District Attorney was already shaping up to be a free-for-all, with incumbent Leon Canazero seen as vulnerable and his chief challenger, Councilman Jason Williams, under federal indictment, charged with tax fraud. Today, the race got even more intriguing, with criminal court judge Kiva Landrum Johnson expected to join the fray. It is expected that uh, former judge Arthur Hunter will announce tomorrow and I expect former Senator J.P. Morrell to make a decision by the end of this week or Monday at the latest. Insiders had all but ruled out Landrum Johnson running against her ally, Williams. But WWL-TV political analyst Clancy Dubose says Williams' legal troubles appear to have changed all that. Have you ever seen a citywide election in New Orleans like this take this kind of shape so late in the game? And I have never seen a citywide race for a big office like this in more than 40 years gets so scrambled and have everything thrown up in the air. The DA is underwater, his major challenger is now under federal indictment. It's like somebody took all the marbles and threw them up in the air at one time. While Arthur Hunter resigned from the bench in February to run, Leandrum Johnson would have to do the same with qualifying starting a week from Wednesday. J.P. Morrell, meanwhile, is expected to announce his intentions any day. Mike Perlstein, Eyewitness News. We should also point out that Canazero has not announced his intentions. It's unusual for an incumbent so close to the qualifying period. Dubo says at least one other judge is also looking at the race if Canazero decides not to run.